is Anna and this is Elizabeth and today we're going to make a delicious Moroccan staple, couscous, with lots of lovely vegetables in. First things first, have you washed your hands? Yes. Let's cook, cook along. along! Let's go through all the equipment that we need. We've got a colander, a bowl, a small measuring jug, a large one too, a beaker and some scissors, weighing scales, chopping boards, a wooden spoon, some measuring spoons, a sharp knife, a fork and a tin opener. We're going to go through all the ingredients. What have we got, Elizabeth? Couscous. Yes. Tomatoes. Garlic. Garlic and? Coriander. Anna, what have we got here? Lemons. Do you know what this is? It's stock. It's vegetable stock, in fact. We've got? Corn. Sweet corn, that's right. Black pepper, olive oil, peppers and? Do you know what kind of onions these are? Springy ones. <laughs> First of all, what we're going to do is actually get the couscous prepared. We're going to get some boiling water on and measure it out in the jug. There we go. And we need a bowl. So what we need to do is switch the scales on and we need to set it to zero. And then, Anna, could you weigh it out to yeah. the number 200? We need 200. Zero, zero. You watch for me, Elizabeth, and tell her when to stop. 190. 200! Brilliant. Can I feel it? Yeah, do. Have a feel. What's it feel like? Prinkly snow. Prinkly snow? <laughs> Once we've added the boiling water to it and the stock, it'll actually change its consistency from hard to quite a spongy feel, almost a bit like pasta. So the next part we need to do is actually get the stock ready. So we're going to boil the kettle and once it's ready we're going to measure about 250 mils of water into the jug. Press pause now and we'll see you in a moment. We've got our water ready. The water will be very hot so be careful. Ask an adult to help you. So we're going to add our stock in now. Why don't you open it up for me? Plop it in. Be careful because it's very hot and it will spit back out. Ooh. There we go. We need to now mix the stock into the hot water until it melts. Come here! There we go. Right, let me take this bit, on because it's... It smells really minty. Minty? Yeah. We've mixed it all up. We're going to pour it all in now. Let's do it together because it's boiling water, remember? And then yeah. I'm going to get Elizabeth to give it a stir. Make sure we've got all the liquid incorporated with the couscous so it all soaks up and gets lovely and tasty. There we go. Thank you, Elizabeth. Oni, okay. have a quick go. What we need to do now is actually cover the bowl with a tea towel, leave it for about 10 minutes and let the stock work its magic on the couscous. Thanks, Elizabeth. Thanks, Anna. Let's get that out. There we go. Let's pop that to the side, Oni. Is that okay? There we go. Let's get on with the vegetables. Put the tomatoes in, the coriander, the peppers in for me Pepper. and the spring onions. Right, so Elizabeth, can you go and wash these for me? Thank you. We're using red and green peppers today, but of course you could use yellow or orange too. What we need to do now is get the girls chopping. Yes, please. There we go, Anna. Thank you, I love this one. Brilliant. Elizabeth, I'm going to get you to do the peppers. I'm going to oh. chop the bottoms off. Stop them from rocking and rolling. We're using our bridge rocking technique again. Rocking and rolling. Woo -woo. Oh. And then I'm just going to take the edges off for you. Ready? I've chopped the pepper ready for Elizabeth because I'm going to get her to use the scissors. Elizabeth, if you can just do strips up with the peppers and then when you get the strips, cut them into little pieces for me. Okay? Excuse me, Brilliant. Thank now you. My oh, turn. Yes, Anna, we need to peel the garlic. Let's chop the bottom off. Now you can get, take the skin. And then I'm going to get Anna to fork secure the garlic and chop it through the prongs of the fork. Can I do this end? Yes, please. So what we need to do is do nice little strips. That's it. Well done, that's brilliant. You're doing really well, Elizabeth. You're flying through that. And Anna, you're doing really good too. That garlic is strong again, isn't it? It's great. Now, Anna. Now that we've done that, shall we do the spring onions? Yeah. 
the nicely washed and cleaned and stripped of any of the old parts of the leaves if there happens to be any so I'm going to take the edge off actually it'd be better that way for you okay. and then you can hold it nice little rounds well done fantastic Anna. it's really good to have a stable board you can put a wet tea towel underneath or have one like this which has rubber strips on it just so that the board doesn't slip what we're going to do now is keep on chopping. Press pause now and we'll see you in a moment. Anna's just finishing off the spring onions. Elizabeth has just finished the peppers, so I'm going to get her to do the coriander. Elizabeth, can you just put some leaves of the coriander inside the beaker? You want to just separate them and then chop it with the scissors for me. That'd be great. Whilst we carry on chopping, why don't you press pause now and then you can catch up. What we need to do now is open our can of sweet corn, drain it. We've done ours already, so here we go. And then we're going to add this to the couscous as well. Right, we're going to give it a check. Here we go, so we'll uncover it. I'll move that. Wow, look at that. What do you think? Should we fluff it up a bit? Elizabeth, can you just do that and break it up into little pieces? Just using your fork will help break it up and uh, make it nice and light. Brilliant. So once the couscous is cool to touch, it's ready to add all the vegetables. So tell me what we're going to put in then, Elizabeth. The pepper, yep. the spring onion and, and the sweet corn. Perfect. That's going to be our rainbow effect. So would you do that then, Elizabeth, please? What about me? You can put the spring onion and tip in the sweet corn for me. That'd be great. So there's our peppers. Anna. You can put in the onions then. Yep, perfect. Sprinkles. Sprinkles. Yeah. Onion sprinkles. <laughs> and then pour in the sweet corn. Wait. <laughs> Are you having a nibble? Secret jump. <gasps> Keep going. Hi. Ready, Anna? Yeah. Put those in. Brilliant. Can I mix it? There we go. Yeah, give it a mix. Get all the couscous round. You need to get all the couscous from the is bottom and mix it all the way through. Yes, it is a type of salad, you're right. Yeah. Look at all those rainbow colours, Anna. Don't they look great? Can you tell me which ones you've got in there? Um, we've got red, green and yellow. We have great colours there. What we're going to do now is get the dressing ready for the couscous. Let's pop this aside and we need to squeeze a lemon. We've got a small jug here. Elizabeth, I'm going to get you to cut it for me. Well done. There we go. And then use your fork to squeeze in into the bowl. How much have we got in there? Oh, I think that's about right. We need 30ml of the lemon and now we need to put in 75ml of the olive oil. Anna, will you pour and I'll tell you when to stop. We've got the measurements on the side of the jug here so we can actually see on the side. Perfect. You've got a little bit of pips in there. That's not going to matter. We can take those out in a second. Do you want to do a twist for me, yeah. Anna? So we're going to do a nice twist of pepper as well. I'll hold the bottom, you twist the top. Good girl. Right, there we go, Anna. Thank you very much. That's fabulous. So we're going to use our fork and give it a stir. We're going to mix the lemon and the olive oil together. Okay. What we need to do now, Anna, can you pop the garlic in? There we go. And there we go, Elizabeth, if you can put the coriander in. You put Fab. all the ingredients in. Yep, put all the ingredients in and then we'll add it to the couscous. Wow, look at that. Can you see how it's all come together? This is called an emulsification. Can you smell it? Smell it? Oh, it's lovely, isn't it? Elizabeth, I'm going to get you to mix it all in. And Anna, can you pour it in? Make sure you've got it all through there for me. Fantastic. Thank you, Anna. We've mixed it all together. We've got the lemon juice and the olive oil coating all that lovely, soft, delicious couscous. So there we have it, rainbow couscous. Girls, do you want to have a taste? Yes. yes. There we go. One for you. One for you. Have a nice spoonful. Oh. What do you think? Is it delicious, Elizabeth? Mm -hmm. If you'd like to have a go at another recipe, there are more cook-alongs for you to explore. We'd love to see what you made. Take pictures and tweet them to at Eat Happy Project, hashtag Let's Cook Along. So girls, did you enjoy making the rainbow couscous? Yes, yes. yes.